If you want to win more singles matches, here are three simple strategies that you should start using. Go ahead and click the subscribe button, that little bell on the top that will tell you when I'm putting new content out. And now let's get started with strategy one. All right, when you're in trouble and you're being pushed back behind the baseline with a higher or heavier ball, go and return that high and heavy cross court. Number one, you have more time to come back forward to the baseline. Number two, ideally you want to bring that ball back up above the shoulder of your opponent and pin them back behind the baseline. So go cross court with good net clearance, about five, six foot. So high and heavy cross court when you're in trouble behind the baseline. Strategy number two, give yourself the biggest area of the court when you're returning good first serves. So instead of going for the corners, you want to go deep through the middle and you want to basically pin your opponent right in the center of the court. And here's why. If you're going for corners, you go for broke, what you're actually doing is you're allowing your opponent to counter angle you, to open up angles against you. So let's say you're going for the corner here, the at corner, your opponent has the easiest shot, a backhand or even a forehand if it's a lefty cross court, which makes you have to run a whole lot. Go and cross court for the deuce corner if it's a right-hander is still a better option than going for the outside. However, if that lands anywhere short, your opponent can attack that ball and open up the court here and attack you, or they can go right behind you. So your best target, again, is, as one of my coaches said, shove it right down their throat through the center of the court and start out the point with less angles for them to hit into. Strategy number three, sounds like the most obvious thing on the planet, but I see it all the time when I see recreational players play. Get your first serve in. People are trying to hit way too big of a first serve up to a very high level. You are not going to win matches and or your service games even by hitting aces but you're losing them by giving your opponents too many looks at your second serve because everybody, when they're seeing a second serve, they are trained to step in and attack it. So make sure that you get a good first serve percentage, maybe take a little bit of pop off, add more spin, and aim for a first serve percentage around 65 to 70%. That would be phenomenal. So go out, hit a couple of buckets of serves because it's the only shot we can train when we don't have to have a partner.